Ooh. Oh, I like that. I love that ending. Not because it's the end, but that low, <laughs> that low stuff. Is that a keyboard thing? Uh, yeah, yeah, the whole conglomeration. It sounds I think. like it. Yeah. yeah. Uh, to, I, I don't know whether you'd like to hear this or not, but that sounded so near to the original that it was excellent. Great. You know what I mean? I know, Great. I know you want to put your own twist on it. But uh, we, we try to keep it, you know, as close as we Yeah, can. I mean, it, it was good. I thought Steve on vocals was excellent. Brilliant. Yeah, off, he did a great bit. job. Yeah. And if you, you know, we were talking, but if we'd listened to the solo as well, the yeah. guitar solo. What it's I'm going to and, and the keyboard solos. Yeah. You know, which in the old days, that was the important thing. The song came in between the solos. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. In the prog yeah, days. Yeah, there's, yeah. A, there's, a, there's a bit of a joke about um, uh, prog being all solos and one thing and another. And yeah, I, yeah. I read it somewhere, the definition of prog, and it was really taking the mickey. Yeah, yeah. Of course. <laughs> extended but solos. If, and if you can't laugh at yourself, yeah. you know. But it's good. It's, it's, to me, it's thinking man's music. Progressive music. Yeah, yeah. It's a bit more than just bash, bash, bash. But there's always something that was written about Emerson, Lake and Palmer, wasn't it? It was Keith Emerson and the other two. Yeah, 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 <laughs> yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. Carl would love that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, mean, Carl, yeah. I actually saw Emerson, Lake and Palmer on the, uh, oh, crumbs, when was it, 1973, 74, on the Brain Salad Surgery to yeah. Quadraphonic Sound. Uh, Alan Freeman introduced them. And, uh, and Keith Emerson was my hero at the time, but Carl Palmer's drumming, I mean, he just got layer upon layer of drums. And that was the one where he played it with his teeth, the bell with his teeth. And, yeah, yeah. And then they had this drum synthesizer thing, every time he whacked it, Emerson's mm -hmm. key, uh, synthesizer would go, all sorts of things going. Yeah. Good, anyway. <laughs> What's that got to do with anything? Um, so that's two of your tracks off of your... Uh, well, thank you for that. That's not a problem. It's Kent music, you know. It was recorded in Kent. Was it? Yeah. It says there. Give the, give the studio a plug then. Who's this, who's this artwork by Christine? Uh, I did the logo. I designed the logo. Christine did the, um, did the, the whole design. She's not sitting in the corner nodding. <laughs> <laughs> no. No, it's recorded at Anchor Baby Studios. Oh, that's um, Dan, 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 Dan Lucas. Lucas. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, good old Dan. He's come in for, for an interview before now. Yeah, good stuff. He's a yeah, good he's, man. he's very good at his job. Yeah, he is. Well, he's, you can hear. You just... He was with a band called Jerus. Did he tell you all about that? Uh, he's in a few bands. Yeah, he's toured, toured Europe and done all sorts. Yes, stuff, he so. has. Yeah. Yeah, a very experienced guy. Yes, yeah, and he's and only a youngster. He is, well, I wouldn't say youngster in his presence. <laughs> <laughs> but yes, uh, uh, he's done a hell of a lot for yeah. his age. Yeah, yeah, um, yeah. You know, he looks a lot younger than he is, actually. Oh, does he? Yes. Yeah. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> right, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to find out how old he is now. Yeah. Like, he's 23. Never mind. <laughs> No, he's, uh, he did a wonderful job for us. Good, and, uh, good. Uh, I want to go back again. He yeah. doesn't know that yet. Does he not? <laughs> he might know it now. Well, yeah, I mean, he might listen to the podcast. We don't know <laughs> Slipknot, any views on them? Have you oh, seen them? Yeah, I, I saw them at Download. I went with uh, my son Jack to Download ooh, quite a few years ago. They were headlining. Yeah. Uh, they were fantastic. Yeah. Talking about Jack, let's just get a couple of minutes in for Jack. We'll just run through what Jack's doing at the moment. Because um, he's a drummer. Yeah, my, my son Jack. Yeah. Uh, my other son Callum is also a drummer. He That's lives right. in Canada. Um, uh, Jack is playing with uh, a couple of bands. Uh, Arrestia is one, which okay. is Maystone based. Yeah. Um, heavy rock is the way I would uh, yeah. say it. Um, and he's also in a band called Prota Field, um, which is original music as mm. Arrestia is um, and mm. maybe he should come in and talk to you yeah I, I think he did did you say he was uh, supporting hell yeah or something or he's just come off the road from supporting yeah. hell yeah, yeah. Uh, which is Vinnie Paul's band okay uh, Vinnie Paul and uh, the guy from Mudvayne I can't remember the bass player from Mudvayne right back but with four strings you out there would know that <laughs> no, yeah. I <laughs> And I don't. You, do you know, one, I, don't, I don't know whether you remember saying this, once upon a time, um, you did say to me that what you'd like to do is play drums with your sons. Yes. All together. Slade and sons. Yeah, yeah. Like, that's obviously not materialised uh, I've done it with Jack, I have not yet 
played the three of us together. Yeah, the problem with that is he's on the other side of the pond, isn't he? Yes. Callum. Yeah. Yeah. Do you ever see him much? Or? Um, yes, uh, when we were in the States recently, yeah. uh, Christine and I, we, uh, yeah, we, oh, we saw them. We stayed with my daughter and Callum and his family came down from Canada. Uh, they just moved to Calgary. Oh, Which right, is yeah. uh, cowboy country. Oh, is it? Yeah, it really is. I remember it from, didn't they have the Winter Olympics or something there at once? once they, I'm sure they did. You're intelligent, Steve. Calgary. Oh, that's sport, isn't it? Oh, of course, yeah. You yeah. know, when you watch a uh, Western yeah. and, and at the end the Calgary come in? Uh, <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> On that note, I'm going to say good night and have another <laughs> pint. <laughs> That's not a problem. I'm going to play some Slipknot. <laughs> this is their new single. It's called The Negative One. Apparently about their uh, drummer that's left them, or they fired him, Joey Jordanson. Which oh, I really? Know. I right. didn't know that. No, I didn't. I read it yesterday. Really? Yeah.